And I'm Michael Spencer. Colorado has some of the highest numbers of auto thefts in the country, but law enforcement is doing a good job of recovering those vehicles. Data from the Colorado Th Auto Theft Prevention Authority shows that in the first quarter of 2023, roughly 82% of stolen vehicles have been recovered. If you exclude motorcycles and trailers, which are harder to find, that number actually jumps to more than 90%. But putting criminals behind bars is a different story. Your reporter Olivia Young talked to authorities in Douglas County and Olivia, they caught three suspected thieves in the span of just 24 hours. That's right, Michael. From Sunday to Monday, there were three car thieves that they did catch here, but that's not even a record. The sheriff tells me they've seen six auto theft cases just in the last several days. But while they are catching more of those thieves, less of the theft cases are actually originating in Douglas County. Suspected car thieves from Aurora, Denver, and Colorado Springs all caught in Douglas County in a 24-hour period. We're identifying these people who are in stolen cars, and we're going after them, and we're stopping them, and we're making arrests. But Sheriff Darren Weekly says thefts in the county are down 27 percent, and cars eluding police are down 44 percent since last year. Douglas County is an anomaly. Motor vehicle theft is going down in our county, and I think that a big part of that is our aggressive approach to catching criminals. License plate readers are a big part of the department's strategy. Placed on major roadways and in every patrol car, they automatically alert if a license plate passes by that's been linked to a crime. Those license plate readers are also good to identify sex offenders, to identify vehicles that are associated with people with uh, arrest warrants and things like that. So it's a game changer for law enforcement and it's proven to be uh, very useful. The sheriff says many of the thefts come from other jurisdictions and involve other crimes. It isn't just a, just a stolen car. There's a lot of other crimes that are associated. Stolen credit cards, drugs. And the more everyone takes precautions, the less criminals the department will have to chase. If people would just lock their doors, lock their windows, take their valuables um, out of public view, uh, we'd have a lot less crime in Douglas County. So again, locking your car and removing valuables is the best thing that you can do to minimize the risk of your car being stolen. But another thing, even though it's tempting on cold days like this, do not start your car and leave it unattended in the driveway. In Douglas County, I'm Olivia Young covering Colorado First. A uh, good reminder for everyone, Olivia. Thank you. Olivia stays on top of issues in Douglas County for you. She grew up in Doug Co. and she is your reporter if you live there. You can reach her through our website, cbscolorado.com, or give her a call on our tips line. You can leave her a message there as well.